All right, welcome. Um, once again, we have Suvas as um, another speaker today. He has been in the community for a number of years. And um, I'll pass on to Suvas. Suvas, if you don't mind introducing yourself to our uh, viewers, um, whatever you would like to say, and your journey to WordPress. Well, uh, if I remember the journey on WordPress, especially in case of community, working with the community here in Nepal, it's, it has been really awesome. I still feel excitement. Uh, I like to introduce with the date of 2012. 2012. Uh, right. It okay. was a, it was a very scratch start actually, uh, along with Sakin Shrestha, Ujjwal Thapa, Chandra Marjan, and me together were uh, on an idea to establish a WordPress community here around, around Nepal. So it was our big vision and mission itself. Very so, good. Uh, to introduce myself, I'd like to call me as a WordPress enthusiast, uh, working since long and enjoying to work in the WordPress community. Thank you. Um, you have a topic today as lineup community and connect unity. Sounds very interesting to me. Thank you. Would you mind telling three to five important things that our viewers can take away or you'd like to enlighten? In that topic. Yes, uh, while well, working in the community and uh, doing different meetups, conducting meetups, and talking on meetups and word camps, uh, and listening to the different topics of uh, colleagues, um, I come with the idea of why not we combine three different things. One first local one, mm -hmm. second one is uh, global uh, aspect, uh -huh. and what the government is actually doing. Uh, lining and lining up means. Lining all of these aspects in a line to the part of the community, right. and obviously community involves people, so right. there, there will be different people's story. So right now I'm just here after finishing the session itself, so it won't be very uh, much big deal to relate it into the conclusive and abstract things. Right. Firstly, uh, what I see when working on the community part is there are, there are different expectations of the people. Mm -hmm. Firstly. People have seek for opportunity, and definitely we do that. Right. Uh, then after they seek how then their career can be improvised over the time, and uh, then after the second thing that comes to the picture is technicality. Right. So for that technicality, I give the name of connectivity. Connectivity. And okay. Opportunity itself mm -hmm. is there, mm -hmm. and for combining all this thing, we are the social uh, being. So mm -hmm. community definitely involves there. So. So combining all these three terms, community, opportunity, and connectivity, uh, I come up with the approach of uh, uh, launching a project called Connect Unity in the 2019. So where what this uh, community around the nation will be working on this project. But, but this is not very big new thing because we have started this at uh, 2015 at WordPress Bharatpur. The small, uh -huh. small aspect. Mm -hmm. So my presentation was government is coming with the new plan. Mm -hmm. Actually, we call it as a IT Act. Mm -hmm. Now Nepal government. IT Act. Uh, Nepal government is fascinated with the things like smart city. Mm -hmm. uh, we do have uh, a lot of hindrance on digital divide, where many people are without uh, the presence of digital media or okay. digital presence. Uh -huh. So what was can be the thing what was uh, has uh, got an opportunity to connect them in a platform to uh, make them in a platform uh, in a blog. For example, I'd like to g give you what was Humla. Mm -hmm. uh, the marginalized people of Humla actually got connected on WordPress through right. the blogs. So right. that, that's, um, that's, awesome. Mm -hmm. uh, that's awesome. And conclusively what I tell was, it's a multi-stakeholder platform and it's a community is itself a bond of people. Right. So I requested and urged the community members to work on connectivity. So that means we are doing uh, some uh, fascinating things. Like awareness is the one to make the decent right. presence. Second one is uh, train peoples. Third mm -hmm. one is empower them and, and make them an entrepreneur. Very nice. That's a very, very important message that Subhas has just uh, given to us and um, it definitely will enlighten upcoming um, word pressures or the community itself. Um, another question for you, uh, Subhas. Um, what are your suggestions for the word pressure newbies, the new people that is trying to come into um, building up a website or like, mm -hmm. you know, the platform uh, of WordPress. Um, anything that you would like to tell them? Yes, right now, uh, what I feel 
fascinating about is I compare two things, Facebook and WordPress, right? Uh -huh. Facebook is being so crazy, the number of users are increasing on and on and on. Right. Similar is the story of WordPress itself. Mm -hmm. WordPress has now 60% plus presence on content management system. Whereas, whereas it do have presence of 30% plus mm -hmm. on, on whole website. So wow. this is a good statistics. Like That's CNN, yeah. all of these platforms are being powered on WordPress. In case of Nepal, online cover, which is one of the biggest platforms, is, is also powered by WordPress. So what I see for the new being is WordPress is very easy to follow. Mm -hmm. Because it's like just uh, creating some content and getting uh, there on, on the WordPress platform where there is dashboard that is very easy to customize, customize in the sense of adding, adding content, yeah. editing content. So anybody can do that. Even mm -hmm. a layman can do that. Mm -hmm. So newbies can uh, get attracted here. Mm -hmm. So secondly, Gutenberg is also coming here. Mm -hmm. So Gutenberg can be the next platform where the uh, developers can focus on. Also, for the small small websites mm -hmm. wordpress is very easy to go customize right and right. and it, it, it is uh, creating an impact impact not only in the case of community right. but impact in the case of opportunity and making the career right, in terms of economic benefits as well beautiful thank you you have touched gutenberg right. um Im implementation right. in wordpress right. give us slightly more uh, information or knowledge about that platform uh, it's a, a platform, right? Uh, especially uh, React developers are more fascinated here, I, I, if I see that, right? So, uh, for the case of now, there, there are two different part of story as a, as a side of the coin. Mm -hmm. Firstly, uh, some classical points are being used still mm -hmm. that, that should not be ignored. Right. Whereas uh, the new concept of Gutenberg is like, uh, I think the developers will get more, fa more fun and more uh, ease to use it, mm -hmm. but I think the transition is taking time. Perfect. Um, last question for you, uh, Subhas. Um, what do you do for fun beside WordPress? If we forget about the WordPress, <laughs> okay. what do you do for fun? Okay, well, I will say the thing that I'm doing currently is uh, is the thing that I'm not doing to sustain myself, uh -huh. but I'm doing it for fun. Okay. Uh, so I'm uh, representing three different sectors, right? Uh, so I'm academic lecturer. Right. Um, I do lecture for CSID program, BMBC, nice. a lot of program uh, at different colleges, especially community colleges where they are okay. less infrastructure, uh, where they are That's less resources. Nice. Uh, in the morning time, I do lecture there. And then after, in the daytime, I have my own company called Stupa Technology. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a WordPress company right, itself. Right. So I'm, I'm as a QA, QA there and a system analyst, I'm working and it's, it's, it's being a very fun, fun there. Okay. And thirdly, in, in part of community, uh, I've been uh, creating uh, projects and then back. So if you ask uh, again, WordPress comes, comes in there. <laughs> yeah, comes there. So, so it it's not going to leave you. Right. So I like to share my own experience. I've been to Pokhara, I've been to Bharatpur, I've been to Biratnagar, I've been to Nepalgarh, Zungla, and all these people meeting, uh, meeting for the community case, uh, presenting, talking about WordPress, uh, talking about meetups. So it's it's gradually not increasing my network, but it is increasing my family. So when I move to Pokhara, I simply can call my colleague at WordPress, hey, I'm here. So they come and we have a good time. When I go to Biratnagar there, I can find people there. So isn't it a fun itself? So it is. so it comes into the picture actually. Right. So you include fun yeah. along with the WordPress. Yes. Along with that community. Exactly. So everything comes with the WordPress, but then fun elements are added to it. Yes, that, that's that's what the WordPress Nepal community is uh, so interesting and it's evolving with the power itself. Because we know uh, when uh, in the transition time of 2012, uh, we have set on different uh, platforms, set on different meeting, as I said, uh, the very uh, pioneer stock infrastructure on the Mars and Ujjal Thapa. We had done a lot of a lot of QA, a lot of exercises, and this community is not created for simply conducting meetups and formal ideas, but right. it's an informal channel where we do create fun. As a, I remember still, I'm still uh, my story is moving on in my brain. Your brain. Actually, we had okay. before party, right? right? So we gather, we had the fun, we sing songs, <laughs> we talk about WordPress, we talk about our story. So that is the power, and right. that is the bonding. 
Right. All right, viewers, that was Subhas Karka with us, and we would like to extend our thank okay, for thank you coming as well. in here. And I especially thank the WordPress because it is uh, what we call it is especially giving its empowerment story and its creating a story. It is. Uh, um, educating people about WordPress and it has been one of the official partners as, as well, which I also presented there in my uh, slide there. So right. I'll especially thank the WordPress on my behalf and, and, and on the behalf. Of thank you well. very much for that kind words. All right, thank you very much for your time. Thank you. Thank you. Have also. a good day. I would like you to introduce to our viewers um, about introduction as well as your journey toward WordPress. Mm -hmm. Sure. Um, hi everyone. Hello. So I'm um, Avinash, I'm primarily a programmer. I've been